I'm Ed Sheeran, I'm an acoustic singer-songwriter from Suffolk and I'm playing Barn in the Farm Festival 2011. This is the A-Team. White lips, it is literally face, a bounce. Breathing a in snowflakes, burnt lungs, sour taste. So we're in the heart of a farm right now. Lights gone, days end, struggling to pay rent. You're in a barn, man. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? And you don't normally get that. They say she's in the class 18. She's stuck in her daydream. Been this way since 18. But lately, the face seems slowly sinking, wasting. Crumbling like pastries and they scream The worst things in life come free to her Cause she's just under the upper hand And goes mad for a couple grams And she don't wanna go outside tonight Cause in a pipe she'll fly to the motherland And sell off to another man It's too cold outside Angels fly This is how kind of uh, music is meant to be listened to. It's intimate and it brings it back down to just uh, a man and his guitar, I guess. Barn on the Farm, how are you feeling today? I've been in there and seen a few bands. It's great music and a really cool bunch of people in there. It's just a different vibe out here. I think there's something about here that makes people just kind of be free and enjoy the music. So that's what they like. Assumptions, they always make a fool out of you could be really soulful acoustic music and they'd be like loving it you know and then the next minute it could be like a really pop sort of band on stage going nuts and they'd be into that as well let me ask you then what you know what you know what you know about what you know what you know what you know about what you know what you know what you know about me you know did this go did this go what you know what you know what you know about festival like this, everyone's just really close and personal and really enjoying and connecting with the musicians and the audience. You know about me. You ready? It just feels like there's a lot of my mates who are playing in the middle of the countryside. It's nice to see a festival which is like you know not not being taken over yet by the yeah. sort of corporate end of things. It's small, but it's still a lot of people enjoying it's themselves. Very homegrown. In comparison to the big festivals, this is intimate. It's friendly and it's a lot less stressful. We just came here and we're having a great party. We go through Barn on the Farm. You walk down the campsite and all you can see. It's just guitars everywhere. And I like the way that all the bands are staying over as well, because you get to like chat with them. So you can hear them jamming whilst you sat down by the Crowd and stuff with guitar is amazing. You've got someone standing on a stool right in the middle of everyone. Like the room was packed, it felt like it was just you, him. It was like being in a little pub at the end of the night and someone's brought a guitar down. It's the sort of festival I'd love to come to, just 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 from the intimacy. I'd prefer to sit down with. 50 other people and enjoy an intimate acoustic actor rather than kind of stand around with 100,000 people at Glastonbury and shout. Festivals aren't festivals anymore, whereas this is just like a really cool little homegrown project that they've done amazingly on. It's wicked. Great. I mean, amazing part of the world as well. It's uh, yeah, a real treat. <laughs>